Hi to Chaco. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna taste some of this protein. When I ordered my protein, I got some taste snippets. Pamphlets? It's not really pamphlets. <laughs> because it is uh, food. But I got some extra to, uh, to taste, to test. And I'm gonna try it right now. You know? Let's see. This is. What taste is this? Choco Coco Bounty. They magic going for the, the little skeleton guys. Okay. That's pretty good. I use it all in one sitting. One cup. Just use it all in one cup, guys. What a move there by me. Did he get the both skeletons or just one? Just one, okay. Demon Hunter, just uh, showing up a little bit. Too bad there's no auto camera, but a player's force sometimes we have more important thing to do than cast the game of Warcraft. Hello. Hello. I have to uh, drink my drinks. What? Where does it go? The other side of the map. He doesn't even get a fiery IRO skeleton. Demon Hunter fighting against Grunt. Choco Choco Bounty, <laughs> kinda, but not quite. This grunt is fighting against the Blade Master, but it's a Demon Hunter. Can he win this fight? No. We have a second grunt. The player's forces are under attack. A town is under siege. A town is under siege. What is Demon Hunter? He's fighting, fighting now against the grunt. Can he win this fight? Meanwhile, the Blade Master at the other side of the map. No, going for skeletons. Going for the second Naga Skeleton, and he gets it, and then he's going for the uh, the Fiery Arrow Skeleton. Hmm. Interesting taste. Pretty good taste. Probably better than Monty Python. And uh, did he get the second Skeleton? Wait, what? Did he lose a Skeleton? And he didn't get the second skeleton? Okay, apparently it's not that easy to get the skeletons you want. And uh, there's also a fountain over here. Can he not use that? Is this not a power fountain? A fountain of power? Oh no, he has another one over here. Okay, okay. It's not like I missed anything. I uh, I saw everything that was important. Those grunts moving up. Now he gets the burning archer skeleton. There it is. So many skeletons here for Bazaar. And what is Sonic doing in the meantime? Hello, Sonic. You have a demon hunter. He has some archers. He's a beast master. Maybe he's purposely letting his opponent get all the skeletons because they cost two supply each. And then he can kill them later with the dudes of the Talon. Very easy to kill. Heavy armor. Here comes the demon hunter and the beast master. They're running through this grassy uh, thing. Did the gun see anything? No. Didn't see anything. Oh, maybe he did see something. The peons coming out. Oh no, I don't think he saw anything. Uh, the beast, the Bormel in trouble. We have a raccoon and his berserker strength. Is he going for towers with all these skeletons? I think so. There's a naga. Naga. The beast master with the piggy and the demon hunter here with the archers. Everyone together, working together. What a nice uh, group of, of friends, really. Just look at the teamwork. Just everyone shooting at the same target. This archer, she might hide though. She does hide this burrow. Is it going down? It is going down, right? Yeah. Does he TP out now or does he uh, not TP out? It looks like he doesn't TP out just yet. Is there no dust? There is no dust. Look at these archers just hiding. Triple first arrow. Oh, yeah. Doesn't stack though, so it's not uh, not that great. And there goes the piggy. Poof. Look at the skeleton. It looks so clunky. Look the way it moves. It looks so awkward. Looks like he has bro a broken bone or something. Come on, trees, get out of the way. The town is under siege. A 
Man, that skeleton. It's not gonna live for very long. Purple goes down. Wormill goes down. Means there's no towers going up. Blade Master back here working on this archer. He kills the archer. Wormill is dead. This archer will soon be uh, available to be killed. Blade Master kills one of them, but the Blade Master kind of surrounded. If he can uh, re surround with, his, uh, with something, uh, the piggy is on the way, but he's way too, fa too far away. Blade Master gets away easy peasy. And here we have Ancients of uh, Ancients and Druids of Talent defending. There's still an issue though. Uh, no adapt. Why does he not get adapt? Hello? Sonic, get adapt, please. He's getting another one. He has two movers over here. And so his base is completely closed. But his base is open now. Let's see if we can still hold on here. There's Angels of War over there. The Demon Hunter stops home. The Beastmaster just attacking. He's just so. Uh, he's killing stuff. There goes Druid of Talon. Team Hunter and Mana Burn from 50 on the Naga. One Druid of Talon does go down. These guys do piercing damage. A lot of damage to Druid of Talon. One does go down. Naga is she next. 50 man Mana Burn. She uses Heal Potion. Ace of Winds. Uprooting even. Wow. What a play here by Sonic. All out defense. And uh, Beastmaster has given up on the offense. This tree of eternity is almost done upgrading. Then he can start defending as well. Demon Hunter drinks a bit of moon juice. Uh, the Naga in trouble though. The Naga is so much trouble. Now one dude of the that goes down. This Naga went down. This uh, skeleton is super long hit points as well. The instant war smacks it. It's gone. The D uh, Blade Master, hello. What was he even doing there? GG. You guys can see his flag over here. Then you know exactly where she's from, of course. And uh, he goes, he goes peons. Uh, Altar is going up, and of course barracks going up, burrows going up, uh, peons going up, peons going to go up. These peons are working on the in the gold mine. I mean a little bit. They walk to the gold mine, then they walk out of the gold mine with a bag of gold, and then deliver it to the great hall, and then they go to the gold mine again. They go in and they get another bag of gold. They go back, bring it to the Great Hall. That's their job. Such a nice job, actually. If you think about it, this is a job I could do for the rest of my life. And don't feel like I'm doing something boring. It's just the most exciting job here. Sometimes they get killed, though. Uh, this peon is underway. This peon is underway. It's gonna scout. There's a wisp. What is this? There's an archer. Demon hunter. Moonwall. Wow. Beautiful map. Into the war eats a tree. The archer is shooting at the creepies. Tuscar fighter. He might be a fighter, but can he fight against the Ancient of War? I don't think he should become a fighter, because he doesn't have much uh, skills. He doesn't have much talent for fighting. You know, he should have just become um, a wizard or something. Oh, there! did he get XP for that one? 112? Not sure. I think so. Yeah, I must have. Yeah, I must have. Uh, and there goes another to score. 144 XP now. Mr. Blade Master, he got a nice claws of attack. There's so much damage now. So much damage. Hello. Just look at this uh, sword. So much uh, damage that he does with it. Sentry Ward, where did he place it? Here he placed it. Oh, two peons over here. Let's see what Mr. Shadow Stalker can do. He's trying to kill peons. The burrow here can be cancelled from the right, but that means he's surrounded by one blade master. Where's the blade master? There he is. He sees the blade master, of course. And he doesn't want to be surrounded. Mana burn there on the blade master. So he lets the blade master know, hey, blade master, I can see you. Blade master realizes, hey, he can see me. I'm gonna dust and kill the sentry ward. And that's what he does. Bye bye, sentry ward. And this is a beautiful fight here. Another mana burn would be nice. There it is. Grunt attacks the Demon Hunter once. Does do a lot of damage here. 18 to 21 minus 5 armor. It's a lot of damage. The penguin. Penguin. Just. Beep, 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 beep. Just walking around. Not a grunt. Oh, he's going for the Tuscars. 
Oh, look, they even have a uh, iglo. Oh, you can even select it. Wow. Can you live in it? It has health. Oh, that would be good if you could uh, live in it and it would uh, give you 10 worth of supply. This demon is killing a peon. Oh, nice peon block here with this peon. So, demon are going for uh, another peon. This peon is still alive. You know, he's going for this burrow over here. Is he gonna get it though? Is he gonna get this burrow? We will we have uh, an archer against a spider. Not sure who wins that fight. Demon Hunter didn't get the burrow. But he's so fast and he has staff. And he staffs out. Wow. Nice staff out. Iglo's new burrow, Kappa. Yo, yo, Chaco, Peps. Hello, Ante. Welcome back. Chaco, soon you owe me tacos. Rank uh, 18 yesterday. Ooh. Pretty close. A player's forces are under attack. The Blade Master working on this ice tool. This ice tool trapper. Claws of attack and a circlet. Is this going to die? It dies. Jubei is level 2. Level 2 Jubei. And we have the Beast Master here for Sonic. These grunts take a bit of damage. There's another piggy. These grunts take a lot of damage now. The grunt is pretty much dead. And this other grunt is going for the grunt. No, he go for the bestiary. Beastmaster retreats. He has a staff though. Could save the archer or could come back and save the demon hunter or could save a piggy. The archer running. The archer is too fast for the TC. Haha, <laughs> still old patch. You still cannot catch me. Is what she's saying. But the uh, TC uses shockwave to kill the archer. And uh, the demon hunter does get staffed out. He cancels the bestiary. The blade mash and the TC and the grunt. You know, killing piggies. That's what they do. Chaco, can you make voice of an ice tool? I don't know. I don't know what voice they have. It's not the same as a force tool. Let the killing begin. Beast mash here. We're playing with penguins. Max and Shadow Stalker. They're coming back. They want to do more damage, but there's no bestiaries to cancel. But burrows, there are burrows. Blade Master, Jubei, and Kelstone. Uh, Kelstone Bull, I mean. Kelstone. Kelstone Bull. Uh, creeping over here. Well, he's, he's losing his shop. And what is El Sonic doing? Sonic is getting his Ancient of Winds. Is, uh, I mean, they're already up, but he's getting his uh, Druid of the Talon. He's going back in. What can he do here? He's going for the bestiary. Demon Hunter just right clicking on that bestiary. He takes so much damage, he's gone, guys. Demon Hunter does get staffed out. The Beastmaster now just running. He's just running. Beautiful. This piggy, is he going to die? He's going to die. The Blade Master wants to kill him. Poof. Oh, he's going for the Mammoth. The Mammoth, pretty strong. <laughs> Look at the Mammoth. Oh no, he killed the Mammoth. I was just marveling at his beauty. He has a dab to the of Thailand. He's scanning Master. No, no, no. He's not Tree of Eternity yet. Okay. You will the Beastmaster just over here. Just grunt. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo. Is this a fish? I think this is a fish. This is art. Art of a fish. Do we have art here? We have these beautiful bridges on this man, by the way. Do we have a fish here? I'm not sure if that's a fish. Anyway, what I am sure of is that this mana burn hit the TC right in the face. Level 1, he used the shockwave. Uh, Blade Master takes so much damage. Hello, Scroll of the Beast used, but he has nothing here to use it on. Hello, uh, mana burn on the TC. He is also retreating. He does survive. How come uh, his army is so small? P 
because he got his bestiary cancelled. That's why. Is there no mercenary? He should have just grabbed a mercenary if there's a mercenary. Oh, there's one. He was creeping. I see. And ba oh, but there's, there's different units on this map. Oh, he did buy one of these guys. Magnetar Warrior. Heavy armor. I guess this is not the correct target against Night Elf. Unless he's magic immune or something. He does look pretty cool. Look how look at the move. Look at his back. <laughs> look at the feet in the back. Can you walk again? Wait, wait. Look, he moved all the way back. It is so cute. Anyway, uh, there's more creeps you could bot maybe, you know, like a uh, Furbox Shaman, like a uh, Dragon uh, Spawn Medal. Probably not good, but maybe a uh, Barbut Arachnathid. Peons are dying. Blade Master is flying. And this, this guy with the lance. Oh, he has such a big lance. Why does he use it as a lance? Why does he use it as a uh, as a sword or whatever? Can he not poke with it? Come on. He, he thinks he's a pit lord. He thinks he has cleave. There goes Spirit Walker. Maybe he has cleave, actually. I don't know what skills he has. Uh, we'll look it up later. Magnetor Warrior. Uh, Blade Master is over here. He's flying. He's now fighting. No, he's flying. TC here is uh, still level 2. He's going for the pocket factory. He does get a pocket factory. The demon hunter don't kill this warrior. Hello. He is beautiful. And he is dead. Truth of Talon winning this fight over here. Beastmaster. Going for the TC, but maybe he's in trouble himself. Now how much trouble can you be if you have an army of Truth uh, of Talon defending you? Beastmaster, it is. He does TP out. Magnetor is a real new race in Warcraft 4. Let's, let's google real fast. Magnet Warrior. Warrior 3. Uh, oh, it has spell immunity. Interesting. I was correct. Like I said, so I, uh, like somewhere in the back of my mind, I thought it had spell immunity. And it does have it. So that means. Oh, yeah, it says it. Immune to spells. Means the Druze of the Talon cannot attack it. So even though it has heavy armor, it's uh, pretty strong. It, like, it, like, it has heavy armor because, but it's immune to spells. So in other words, it's immune to his weakness. Immune to magic. And uh, so it's also immune to Cyclone. It's pretty decent damage. 900 hit points. Yeah. I didn't I didn't know you could hire those in this map. So strong. It's not only spells, no. It is uh, all magic attacks. But Sonic is still gonna win his eleventh night supply up. Let's see if he buys another one. He does have the money. I think it's pretty expensive, right? Don't know how expensive. Because uh, a Ragnatic or whatever. Is that Oh, th This is the guys you can uh, hire as well. These little scorpions. Just so cute. They have medium armor. Yeah, get some of those as well. Get some of those. Oh, he gets this guy. Costs 340 gold. These should just be part of the orc army. Would be the counter, perfect counter against the dudes of the Talon. Okay, there's an attack on the main base. Sonic 59 supply, 48 here for Bazaar. The shop is going down. Fairy Dragon doing a lot of damage here. Oh, look at this flank attack with this guy as well. The Magnetor Warrior. Oh, and he's so strong. Oh, Blade Master is flying. Shockwave. It's a few units. Level uh, 2 Shockwave. Blade Master just flying. Still, okay. He goes back. 
This is gonna be so difficult for uh, Bizarre Man. He's 10 supply behind, but he has the Bizarre guy. Uh, I mean, the <laughs> Magnetor guy. <laughs> and he's uh, taking the, the, sh the Pocket Factory. He's like the counter to the Pocket Factory. Because the Druids of Ten and Luke, they're not attacking him because they can't. And he's just. Uh, He's still at 847 hit points. There's another shockwave hitting some more juice of the Talon. Demon Hunter now attacking the TC. But, you know, the TC just saw, lost so much mana to the mana burn. Maybe he can get one more shockwave off soonish. Uh, before he dies. Okay, he's actually just GG. Okay, GG. Beautiful game.